uh, zombie movie from Superstar Rajini. Where did that come from? As it is, the fans are already confused with uh, so many news that's coming out. Uh, every big time director's name is associated with Superstar. Uh, he is said to uh, reunite with Karthik Subaraj. Uh, he is said to be uh, going to come together with Nelson again for Jailer 2. Um, and uh, a bunch of other names are being thrown in. So, why zombie? Zombie, we refer to the undead, especially in Hollywood, uh, zombie movies are common, although maybe not so much in India. So, zombie movies, we see the living undead uh, who are walking around. They're supposed to be dead, but they seem to be alive. So, uh, is Rajinikanth going to be acting in a horror movie, again, after the almost horror super hit Chandra Mugi? Well, actually, this is the reason I use the word uh, zombie. If you see uh, the past two, two, one to two years, uh, there has been this news that is uh, dying and living again, dying and living again. So it's like a living undead news whereby a uh, famous uh, commercial Telugu director called Bobby Koli. Okay, Bobby Koli. This is Bobby Koli, guys. A uh, Telugu director who is uh, quite famous with a recent big hit being Walter Viraya uh, starring Shiranjivi. So Sirenji was so impressed, apparently the grapevine says that he recommended this director to tell a story to Rajini and Rajini also was quite happy with this. If you see this news was hot circa 2023 that uh, Rajini is going to combine in a Telugu film with Bobby Simha. Uh, sorry, not Bobby Simha guys, Bobby Kohli. Uh, Bobby Kohli has a rather complex name. Uh, he is also known as uh, Bobby K.S. Uh, Ravi, uh, which sounds almost like K.S. Uh, Ravi Kumar. Uh, he's known as uh, K.S. Ravindra actually. So, uh, but popularly is known as Bobby Kohli. So, if this uh, Telugu director combines with Superstar, uh, where is Superstar going to squeeze him in? Uh, that's a very interesting question. Well, maybe Superstar is doing a full circle. Uh, back in the early days of late 70s and 80s, Superstar used to just swing to, for the fences with his films, whereby he used to act it up to one dozen films in a year. So, he knows how to do that and now he got so much experience over the years. Uh, next year is his 50th. So, uh, most probably, if the makeup system allows it, he might still be able to work concurrently on the movie Cooley while at the same time uh, looking at uh, Jailer as well as uh, starting this Telugu project. Uh, if the Telugu project's makeup style allows flexibility, then he might even do two or three films concurrently. There'll be a new record. There'll be like a kind of a thing that many uh, will mind. Uh, there's a lot of, uh, you know, stomach burn people around, right? Everybody is jealous of Superstar just charging ahead like a supreme horse even in his 70s. But it'll bring things to a new level uh, and it'll shame a lot of the younger heroes if you could pull off such a thing acting in two or three movies at the same time. And uh, we think it's possible. So do, do not rule out this so-called zombie film which is living and dead, living and dead, living and dead, the Telugu uh, movie of Superstar. So if things go according to plan, we might see some news about this uh, director Bobby Kohli and Superstar Rajinikan combination. Should be an all-out Telugu film with dubbing to Tamil, Hindi and so on. Uh, whether the fans will accept it, that's a very interesting question because uh, uh, in the context of Superstar's Tamil films, we are quite uh, comfy with it. Uh, those who like Tamil action flicks, usually they are able to watch Hindi flicks as well. However, for Malayalam films, it requires a more serious approach and attitude because their films tend to be more social, uh, story-driven, not hero-driven films. Whereas uh, Telugu films are on the other end of the spectrum where it's very much com hyper-commercial and hyper-colorful and hyper-violent. So Tamil films used to be in the middle ground. So if it's an all-out true blue Telugu film, uh, it might turn off some of the fa Superstar fans. So what do you guys think? Do comment whether you guys welcome a true blue all-out Telugu film from Superstar or you prefer him to do Tamil and then dub it into other languages. Uh, well, that, let's not also rule out Telugu films totally because they've been really swimming for the fences, giving a super duper hits like Bahubali and uh, RRR, right? So if that is their canvas, then uh, even Kalki recently, so I think Telugu might become the new epicenter of uh, Indian film industry. Uh, unless Chennai wakes up and catches up to its A day of the 70s, 80s and early 90s to be the uh, ground zero of uh, film industry in India. So guys, uh, whatever it is, it's a, it's a win for the fans, superstar acting in all kinds of films. Uh, let's wish him good luck. Why not? He can even go for full true blue Hindi film and even Hollywood film. There's no limit. Age is just a number. Good luck to superstar and give your comments about what you feel about a true blue uh, full out Telugu film from superstar. Bobby Colley, 
maybe even some other Telugu actors might uh, do special appearance like um, uh, Ram Charan and Ravi Teja. You know, there's a whole bunch of people who love Rajini in the Andhra states. Okay, guys, thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.